If you are struggling with negative anxious thoughts spiraling through your head all day at work, here are a couple tools that can change your life. I want you to think about it. Would you ever dare show up to your office, to a meeting with your manager, with a client, and not brush your teeth, not have showered that morning? Absolutely not. Or at least I definitely hope. Absolutely not. But what about your mental hygiene? If you are living so unconsciously, so unaware of your regular thoughts that are repeated on loop every single day, which most people are, so don't feel bad about it. Imagine how stanky, nasty, dirty that mind is when it's filled to the rim with negative beliefs that you are never clearing from your mind. I'm going to give you three super simple tools that you can do any day while you're at work to help you to relax your mind, to help reframe and shift your mood instantly. If you don't have time to go through this now, make sure to save it and come back to it later. So one is notice the difference between your thoughts and your thinking. And while they may seem like the same thing, they are definitely not. Like for example, if I ask you, how much money would you like to make this year? If you can make any amount of money this year, how much money would you like to make? And just think about it for a second. So you'll notice after I asked you that, a number probably just popped into your head. That pop into your head, things that kind of just seem to land or drop into your mind, like ideas in the shower, those are thoughts. Those are good. Those are coming from the unconscious mind. That is what Einstein literally used to use to be the smartest man in the world. When he couldn't solve a problem, he would literally take a nap and just wait for those pop unconscious ideas to come to him because that is the thinking that's useful. And I bet after that number popped into your head, a bunch of other unnecessary thinking came up. Like, how would I ever make that much? I can never make that much. I've never made that much before. Maybe no one in my family's made that much before. Why did I choose that number? Why didn't I choose a higher number? It literally doesn't matter whatever those thinking thoughts were afterwards, but that's an example of thinking. And literally all of your thinking is completely unnecessary and needed. So notice that. Notice when you're just thinking, spiraling, and be able to catch yourself, bring awareness to it, and realize that you are not those things thinking thoughts. That is not you. That is not your mind. That's just spiraling that you can stop, that you could choose to accept this or let it go. Number two is my energy alignment tool. This is super effective in helping you to shift your mood from anxious to confident or calm, however it is you want to feel. So if you're feeling anxious in the moment, I want you to think of how do you want to feel? So let's say that's confident in the moment. Maybe you have a meeting coming up. So think about when was the last time in your life, the time when you felt the most confident? We're looking for a real actual memory of when you felt the most confident. And I want you to get really specific here. What were you doing? Who's around you? Are you inside? Are you outside? What are you doing? What are people saying to you in this moment of where you felt the most confident in your life? And now this is going to be your energetic alignment tool and you could use this every single day. As you think about this moment, I want you to get really clear on it and really remember how you felt, how confident you felt in that moment and how it felt in your body to feel confident. And just by thinking, mentally rehearsing, remembering this memory, you can begin to embody that confident energy. Because this is a memory familiar to your unconscious mind, it's able, you're easily able to tap into that confident energy very, very quickly. And number three is hypnosis. 95% of the thoughts you think every single day are on repeat. They're all stored in your unconscious mind, repeat on loop. And a lot of the time, like I said, we're not even aware of them. Hypnosis helps you to access your subconscious mind by getting you in a deep, relaxed state. A lot of people have all of these misconceptions about hypnosis but that's all it is it's getting you in a deep relaxed state you're still awake you're still aware you're actually hyper focused while in that deep relaxed state and you're able to become aware of these limiting beliefs in your unconscious mind and recondition reframe reprogram them to feelings thoughts beliefs of more confidence more calm more control of your emotions and thoughts I'm sharing free hypnosis practices that I use daily. Some are as short as five or 15 minutes. You could practice these every single day to help you to embody your most confident self. If you want these, head over to my Instagram and DM me the word mind to learn more.